here we are going to see Mr. Chimandangi of Sowing Seeds Residency. Where is he? Lead the way, Gan Pat. On the way to Mr. Chimandangi out here in the village. And I believe tribal lands. Like cows. Like buffalo. That's, that's. Ah, this is the gate to sowing seeds. This must be Chiman's bike. Yes. This is the gate. It looks like uh, the gate in King Kong. Okay. Looks like the gate in King Kong. The movie. benefiting both the visiting artists but you're also benefiting the villagers because it becomes sort of a almost a cultural exchange. It's the gate in King Kong the movie. Yeah I'm coming. Can I get through? Oh good. Okay. Hello. How are you? Busy working. Okay, more people working. Oh my God. Is this Mr. Chimandangi? This is really nice. I like your gate. I said the gate reminded me of the gate in King Kong. He's artist from Nigeria and he painted this gate. From Nigeria? From Nigeria. Really? Yes. yes. Mr. Chimandangi. And what is the name of this place? This place is called uh, Badanga Art Junction Residency. Badanga. Art Junction Residency. Yes. And we also organize here showing seed uh, international art residency. Well, that's what I thought. Yes. So, so I'm going to have you give me a little tour, just one minute. Hello, this is Wazo X Wazo, Evil O. And today we are outside of Udaipur near Ubishwari G Mandir and we're on a beautiful beautiful piece of land that is known as Art Junction Residency and it is run by an old friend of mine that I've known for so many years 14 years at least Mr. Chiman Dangi how are you Chiman I am very fine are I'm you good very good yeah 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 nice to meet you here it's been um, a long time yes very long time so I think is 2006 we meet in 2006 here yeah we came out here a long time ago uh -huh. when I had my long hair yeah. and we were carrying bottles of beer yeah and yeah. we sat in the dry I think it was the hot season uh, it's hot season it was hot season and we were we sitting, sitting there and, and they were I remember they were pounding or something in the back they were putting in a tube well or something yeah yeah? Yeah, backside, yes, backside. And we were drinking beer and this old man, the old farmer came old up farmer and came joined up. us. Yes, yes, yes. He's leaving in behind and he come. We, mostly when I come here, he come because he's really very, uh, he's uh, unable to walk. He's have leg problems. His wife is also. So mostly when I come here, our friend come, he come and I help him to some for money. So the place has changed a whole lot and we made a, uh, a recording on my mobile phone just a little tour of this place and the way it has changed from being an empty farmer's field to being what it is today and this has all been Chiman's hard work um, creating the house and creating the little cottages for visiting artists. There we go. Okay Chiman, you want to give us a tour? 
Yes, yes. Just Come. to give us a walk around. So here, actually, we bought I think uh, ten year ago the land and uh, want to be create uh, some artistic uh, residency like something. Before I want uh, my own studio. So I there I have my own studio and here is for uh, international artists. I was out here years ago when you just had the land. Yes, yes. And we sat here and drank beer. Yes, we remember we here. Yeah, we and that here and that down. that old here. man came up and, and we joined here. us. Yes, there there was no any boundary wall and just we now slowly slowly myself mostly myself I did work here and try to use. Uh, uh, is ecological and I use re, uh, reusable like a uh, mud, clay, and stone, local available stone, and uh, yeah, what can use reuse even also window and everything. Uh, who is second hand, who is uh, not using, and go to there and collect here. Even I also see the beer bottles. We drink beer bottles also. Ah, okay, <laughs> you make the, the wall out of beer bottles. Yes, okay, so good. Still is the main gate also we are doing now, try to. Uh, finish the slow slow work here i use try to use for uh, you know uh, grass from village and uh, like eco house very and, nice uh, you have a beautiful well i remember you want to show well. your well? Beautiful well you can see and this is for my our swimming pool <laughs> now is no water but i try to be make a more wonderful here i make it a nice uh, mike i remember looking in this well last time i was out here too uh, this one is our all flowing water was and this is uh, uh, they say 200 year old 200 year old well really yes 200 year old well and, uh, so show us what else this is a now, good tour uh this area uh i Want to use for uh, ceramic and uh, clay potter studio, so not finish like it. Wait, wait, I'm missing you. You have to talk at the camera a little. Okay, so this is for uh, clay studio. And, clay studio? Uh, yeah, potter studio. Okay. And this hut's for uh, artist uh, living. So these are artist huts. Yeah, artist huts. For and people who come to the residency. Yes, for residency. Yeah, and they use uh, uh, mud and clay and uh, bricks also. Okay. And uh, this gate you see uh, made by what is available local bamboo. Yeah, and yeah. Not to use any other gate, just bamboo gate. And inside also you can see uh, we use plaster from okay. powder, mud and clay okay. mix, and then we use. Nice this. little view from behind from that window too. And uh, have led by the test here is led by the test. A what? A small led by the test and uh, these two artists can come or one artist. Okay. A small house. They they are same similar same. All are attached led by. So what else you want to show me? So here. This is the garden. We want to be make a beautiful garden and open kitchen here because mostly uh, even artists and also other people who is art lover, they want to come here and stay longer, and they want to make a party here. So I think uh, after you know lockdown and this uh, pandemic time, why not uh, invite uh, other people? And what's this? Is this your house? Uh, this is my house upstairs, my room, and there is I want to make open studio now, but I want to make a glass from. I don't want to close the. Uh, bricks from there because I want to see also open area, beautiful landscape. So I think glass from glass and also curtain. None so, of this was here when I was here last time. Your house hadn't been built. Can we look at the house? Yes, please. Come. Can we go in the front door? This yes. looks pretty. Can we go this way? You're catching up with Bupesh Kavdia. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to interview him also. I went by his house the other day, but uh, we had a nice time, but uh, he had some guests coming, so that's postponed for a while. Well, this is lovely. So here we use, uh, we didn't use any cement here, try to without cement. Uh, because water level can be go off, otherwise we cement everything is water going outside. So so no cement used. No, no cement used. You see here, without cement, they uh, use only mud, and 
stone. Like Only mud and stone. Mud and stone. But you have but some cement up on uh, top. After actually, I was uh, selected in France, and I was France, and I talked to the guys. Please uh, bring uh, grass from uh, river, and uh, at that time was uh, May and June, but. At the end of June, I told, please, before the come, one, uh, at least one month before I have to be dry, the grass, then we can use. They say, yes, 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 yes. When I was in France, I called, uh, they say, yes, yes, we cut it. We all cut it. When I come here and no grass, only a little bit. I say, when, where is this grass? And wait. And that time rain is start. Oh, I no. say, oh, my God, what can do? Otherwise, this big, maybe this, not, uh, this stone will be. Broke down. So they didn't live up to their part of the bargain. So then I the go grass. to I go to in village and I see one house and small uh, wall, not thick even. And he put the top of the uh, bricks, uh, the mud and clay. And then also he used a uh, second floor. He used uh, cemented. I said, oh my God, it's possible. He said, yes, it is possible. So I go there and then on the way, one guy meet me. And he said, what are you looking? I said, I want to look one guy who can be my uh, roof. He said, I can do. I said, okay. And next day he come because he said, if I not come today, rain will become soon. So your house will be damaged if I not come now. I said, okay, done. So now I am happy that uh, I can use, I don't want to use more land. I can use upstairs. So they did it very fast for you yeah, before the monsoon. Yeah. Can we just peek inside a second? Yes. Oh, oh wow. I like the color. You know, I have the same color in my house in Modi Magri. Uh -huh. And I so imitated it with... <laughs> But this is the natural ochre, yes? Yes, this is natural. And you've got a nice collection of uh, pots here. No, are these pots? No, they're candles, glass candles. candles. Yeah, glass candles. And uh, now it's not uh, yet complete. So uh, who is artists coming? Sometimes they are come and they are also joined to do something here. And uh, yeah. It's so nice, Jimin. It really is. This is like a great place. And it's a great place for people to come and hang out. Yeah. yeah. So we'll talk about that with the camera and the microphone, everything properly. Okay, let's just peek through here. This is kitchen. This is the kitchen? Yeah. Oh, is that nice? So it's a mud house with a concrete roof. So upstairs is here is a mud and uh, the kitchen I need you know clean clear so I use, I make my own this uh, being stone because it can clean easy and it's good so I put small uh, tiles like this mm, and this is also second end I go to market and well the second end I bring to from there also many things one of my friend he said you don't have freeze I said no I don't want to use freeze maybe I want to uh, ecological freeze. And he said, no, I, he come and say, okay, I bring for you. And he bring. Well, I know you do everything on a real budget. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I am. Short budget, but slowly, slowly, slowly. Last uh, one year, two more, I am doing work. And now I think uh, in this year I will be complete. Okay. I'm going to stop this and set up the camera and the regular mic. Okay? okay. Okay. I want you to tell us now about Art Junction Residency. What is it and how does it work? Uh, it's uh, uh, part of Sewing Seed Residency that we organize in Rajasthan particularly and that is movable residency, not particularly one place. So every year, December month, we organize residency and uh, even we change the district sense, village sense and this is not permanently. So after, it, it was our f uh, five year project. So me and my friend Vaga and Bupat, we organized together, 2009. This is Bupat Duty? Yeah, Bupat Duty. Okay. We started 2009 and uh, after five year project, we say what we can do now. So my, uh, we say we have to be stop or we have to be to continue. And it's financially we do on self financially, not uh, self funding. No any funding from any government or anything. We try to be government, they didn't give us, but we say okay. When we have money, we organize, otherwise we stop one year and can hold. 
and then many artists say, oh, why are you stop this residency? It's very interesting because it is a, a residency that uh, we can, you know, it is in village residency. So, it is uh, great things that uh, they can, uh, we have many opportunities that artists can do work with villagers, um, and craftsmen, you know, and uh, they also can use landscape, land artist, land, landscape artist. So, they also can use, you know, land art or uh, installation, performance, many possibilities in village. So, why not we, why not you continue doing, I say we have financially problem. And then say, okay, so that is, yeah, so we, uh, last year, we apply for, uh, for government, can you help us and uh, WZCC, West John Culture Center, they help us for Indian artists. They say we are not uh, sponsor from international, but I say it's fine. You can sponsor to Indian artist. So last year they little bit help us, but other, other, otherwise we did on our self funding. I give you a lot of credit because you've really self funded, and he's been so ingenious in the way you've gathered materials to build this place. You've used found materials. You've obviously used mud and stone construction which is relatively inexpensive. Um, the bottles you were showing me in the tour that you used to build the wall, the recycled bottles. Um, you were showing me the kitchen cabinet mm -hmm. and said that that was just a found piece somewhere yeah. and, and it was good enough that you could clean it up and utilize it. So I give you a lot of credit for all of that. But the thing I don't understand is What's the difference between Art Junction Residency yeah. and Sowing <coughs> Seeds? Because I've heard both, I'm not really sure. Is there a difference or are they the same it is, thing? It is the same. Actually, uh, Sowing Seed was the movable project. And we think uh, Udaipur is the best city to live in even and uh, beautiful city. Weather is according weather and everything. We visit also, we stay uh, four or five years in Mumbai, Delhi, Vadoda, different, different places. We stay and work there. But we finally we found that Udaipur is the best city to live, yeah. and artistic city. So why not we permanently organize residency? Many artists, even swing seed artists, after swing seed they say, "Oh, we are going to Udaipur. We want to visit Udaipur." And then I, most that time we I live in Mumbai. I say, "Okay, uh, why not we uh, buy land and then permanent?" They say, "Can you book my hotel?" Please, can you book our hotel? I say, okay, we will try to, I talk, call to friends, expensive hotel, okay, budget hotel. We want to budget hotel and uh, we want to touch with local people even, not only stay in hotel. And then I say, okay, finally, I say, why not I organize then some artistic and they also want to visit here and stay long times, so they can do permanent residency, not movable. Movable is more expensive than permanent. Okay. So, Art Junction is the name, we put the different name, uh, the part of the sewing seed is the project. So, Common Art Foundation through we organize Common Art Foundation. So, men is the Common Art Foundation and sewing seed is the residency is the part of the Common Art Foundation and then part of the Art Junction residency. Other side, my friend, other friend is organized in uh, Siroi district. I want to just clarify then, so then you have Indians participate in sowing seed in Art Junction or is it mostly foreigners and people who come they have to pay a fee, correct? Yes. To participate, they pay a fee or they give a donation, however you want to word it. Um, and so, I mean, I've seen these beautiful photos of you with the people out and sleeping in tents. I think that was sowing seeds. Yes, yes. You did that in a few different places and it was always so beautiful because they're all sleeping in tents in a village and then the artists are working with the villagers, which I think is really exciting for people who are Europeans coming here, you know, but also for Indians if they're from a different state, like from the south or something, I think. The, uh, uh, actually, Sewing Seed uh, and Art Junction, we invite uh, open call application and through open call application, we selected, we have jury sitting, the jury and jury decided finally that uh, who is the artist because uh, we got many applications last year, uh, we got 300, around 300, before last year 269 and like more applications and we had to be select the artist because every project and we invite project proposal, they what uh, and we also 
post uh, in website uh, this kind of village, how many people village, how uh, uh, what is the landscape there, uh, which kind of people living there. So all uh, information we put on uh, uh, website and then they are looking through website and even they can call. Uh, if they want more project like uh, something, oh, we have uh, landscape like more uh, flat landscape. We have mountain. So according, they are little bit, uh, you know, they make a project proposal and then send us, and we select. So, and then uh, it is, uh, and sewing seed we are uh, totally giving free of charge, no any uh, fee, food accommodation and art material. Or mostly art material we try to be, they have to be found local available material. So, they can use uh, whatever we available. Even they think if, if we are visit first three days, we only visit the village, landscape and every around uh, residency. And then artist uh, thinking about the own project. We are not forcing that uh, okay, you have to do this, you have project, you have to follow this project and no. If you are not thinking, oh, I, I do not image this or I do not uh, feel anything I have to do, do not do. Okay, so it's very it's, it open. Very it's a very open, open format, which format. is good. It is 15 days, two week residency. So, you know, artists doing uh, more collaboration work and uh, yeah, more many works. So, it is very interesting and people Thanks. love it. This chai time. Yeah. Thank you. Well, Thank you. The chai has appeared magically for you. your helper. So, yeah, it all looks very beautiful when I see it um, on Facebook. I've seen a lot of these photos. I wonder, like, are the villagers, how do they react? Do they profit in some way? Do the villagers get some business out of this? Or um, are they happy with what goes on? Um, just yes, curious. Uh, first times they don't understand what is going on, you know. Uh, when we, so what we can do, first day, we just, uh, I told you before, uh, just visit three days. And we select 15, 50 percent, uh, you know, 50 artists from uh, international and 50 artists Indian. 50 oh, okay. So, you break it down 50, 50. Yeah, 50, 50. Okay. And uh, then they say, oh, they say, they think, oh, it's tourist come. First they say, oh, it's tourist. Right. So, they are, uh, and uh, villagers are, they don't know speaking how to speak English, you know. But it is a good opportunity, the children, mostly for I talk about children is very interesting and very interested to talk with them, but they can't. Then they say, okay, I have to be learn English. You know, it is also is through education, is they can, oh, I have to be learned. So they slowly, slowly start, uh, what is your name? And they say, slowly, so some even women don't understand language, body language, through body language, they invite to them, artists, please come my house stay there, they even eating food there, talking about everything. And they, when they come here, we are sitting there, dinner time, they are talking. Oh, I talk to them, they are very lively, nicely, invite us, blah, blah, they are doing like this. I say, how to do explain? Who is explain? No, 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 we do not need to explain. Mm. So, artist is without, art is Well, it is hard to explain to a villager that you are doing an art installation. But, you know, I remember that, that installation you did at Gallery One when Rajesh Soni and I were mm -hmm. doing those displays oh. in Udaipur. And he made a, Chiman made a gas cylinder out of gober, out of cow dung in the window. It was quite the project. And even there, everybody thought it was crazy. Like, why is he making this big thing out of cow dung in the window? But yeah. once it was done, everybody was amazed. Well, everybody is talking about his thing in the cow dung and... They say we spell and this and I talk. But you to did him. the same installation in same. the village later, yeah. right? Also. Yeah, it's be large, it's like a uh, three meter. No, not more. Uh, Fourteen feet. Fourteen feet means. Yeah, actually, it's about four meters, maybe. Yeah, four meter height and B. Fourteen feet tall. It was yeah. very large. Large level. And but what was the meaning of that piece? And did the villagers the understand? Actually, the meaning it? of this uh, installation, people also save the cow dug, dry cow dug for saving and they make a round shape. So, what when is the water raining, rain season, water going down, not going to wet. So, it is dry. Right. So, I uh, that time is uh, 
uh, sowing seed project, uh, I think first sowing seed, sowing seed project it was and they say we have to be do uh, work with uh, villagers and we have to found object and I say okay. So, every artist are busy with many things and it have to be e ecological uh, environmentally and I say okay. So, uh, just near the residency artist uh, one is women uh, they are making the this construction and I belong to village I know what they are making and I say are this work I can do I say really I say yes this thing is, is kidding I say no no I will do this work and uh, not make a two three I will make a whole large piece of this I say wow is interesting and I say what are you doing they are very curious what are you doing I say okay wait we have to look. So, I make a large lever and I use uh, more than 6000 uh, cow dung old cow. Wow. And, uh, then just they make a same shape, but I just put top. Uh, How did cylinder. they react? Did they think that was funny? Then you make a cylinder. Laughing? I say, oh, it is gas cylinder. They say, <laughs> oh, wow, what is this? I say, it's gas cylinder. I say, yes. So, what means this? I say, we are directly burning. Why not we use this through make a gas, biogas, yes, and yes. easy to use, and also after even we left the cow dog also can use in farm and not have any burning your eyes because uh, you know fog and is coming I say no I say wow it is and I say government that time is government uh, giving many uh, uh, subsidy for uh, put the this plant is very easy very easy. So, I think why not we have to be do this it is eco and every houses and village have every houses cow dog. So, why not we have to even it is why not he have to be used gas yeah. and also be this kind of use. So, it is ecological uh, local available and cheaper. So, it is also not have to be uh, you know pollution I, if you I, fire direct firing. I am curious that was a great project in both places, but I am curious have any um, other artists come and have they created any really memorable installations or art things that you want to talk about something that yes, yes, what, yes. Did, what did anybody do that was quite exciting? Uh, one is artist from Sweta from Badoda and uh, mostly I, many artists did but I like that work. What was his name? Uh, Sweta. Sweta, it's yes, a woman. Uh, yeah, woman. A woman. Uh, okay. And she make a performance there in village and she did a uh, work with cow dug even she use cow dug. So, first she visit the village and talk to the uh, she uh, I think 18 uh, 14 year to uh, 25 year age group she select and she talk to the woman, the girls what you are now doing farming and uh, milking and uh, cooking and this thing. Suppose, if you have education good education what you want to do. Mm. So, some tell oh I want to be I want to be doctor, but my father say what you doing study just go and you have to be make a sapati or you have to be do this in milking or do this. So, right. don't but she want to be doctor she want to be engineer she want to be a uh, different different field police officers this different different field. So, their hope their uh, things that is the story of many, many village girls. Many village girls. Many village and girls. that is they really get is they get I stuck feel being what I call chapati makers. Yeah. So, that is time uh, she what she did uh, she going to writing this thing. My name is Sweta or my name is Sweta I want to I want to be uh, uh, doctor, but my father tell me why are you doing a study you just stop you have to make a sapati and like this <coughs> story every every girls have different different story. She write and then after what she did make a cow dog cake dry and after put wet and put fit footprint on the top. Okay. And then uh, what she uh, the who is the writing the girls and she paste there ah, the stories. Okay. And then uh, she make a on self whole body with a uh, story ah, writing okay. poetic language she put the story and put plastic bags and to cover it full full cover full color everything and uh, see going with the cow dog gag different different uh, stories and going to 
who is sitting on the, on the villagers mostly sitting on groof and sit going to there. Some girls are there with them children and they are reading one is put and reading. My name is Sweta, but I want to be study but now I want to be doctor and but my father tell me blah blah. So now I am farming doing but I want to be this. So how did the villagers react so to villagers that? villagers choked. Oh wow. my god. They, many emotions, many uh, feelings, you know, many hopes we kill it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They choked actually that story. Oh, see her wife or her daughters, her wife, they want to be like this. Yeah. They're going to in mind. So they, they see make a, uh, the she did performance in whole village. I was really That's an amazing village. performance. That sounds really incredible. And Her name many, was Shweta. What's the full name? Uh, Shweta. I forget the name. Not remembering. Okay. Well, people uh, can look it up maybe. Yeah. Anything else that you remember that was a really great work uh, of art? Many other one is Bhupat Duty. He did uh, also project with uh, children. That uh, I've known Bhupat for a long time too. Yeah, you, yeah, you know. Long, long so time. he did work with like uh, children also. First has a first, second, third like a competition, any competition, football, games, uh, manna, mendi, and painting, different, different. And who is going first, second, third? He just giving first, second, third. A jury is villagers and all those things. And then he make a large poster, large poster with uh, like a who is I am first, uh, I just like a first, second or third. I put a colorful poster in the name and the name. And other side like a uh, who is famous uh, women's, mostly the women, not men's, women's. Like uh, Indira Gandhi, he, she was the prime minister. Like a uh, uh, other who is engineer, who is different, different field, who is the famous, like a footballer or a boxer or who is the, all is famous persons well-known persons there with black and white poster picture and other side the colorful the villagers who is first second third and say oh why is she doing with uh, Indira Gandhi she is the prime minister and what why she is posted ah, with okay, colorful yeah, yeah. I, he say she can be go like prime minister or engineer or doctor or whatever if you are doing study through study you can go be like this so what I find wonderful about all these stories is that sowing seeds, art junction, whatever, um, you're really benefiting both the visiting artists, but you're also benefiting the villagers because it becomes sort of a, almost a cultural exchange, you know, between yes, people who are a little more privileged yeah. and people a little less privileged in an economic sense at least. Um, so that's, that's really quite incredible and wonderful. And many other projects, many, I every artist have very different project and they um, uh, use a very sensitive point, sensitive subject. And you're also very concerned about the ecology too. Uh, and and ecology there's a too. big strain of eco ecological concern in your work. Because um, here have many opportunity, you know, large opportunity. They, uh, last year, she make here whole mountain, he put the blue color and she make use the, the whole mountain. So it's have they also every artist have a studio, but when come out through a studio, we giving more opportunities here have more. So tell <laughs> us, um, I don't want these to get too long. I try to keep them to be about a half hour. So I just want you to tell us if somebody's interested. I know this year you've been very slow because of the whole COVID thing and the lack of flights, etc. But when things start to go back to normal, which they will. Um, how do people connect with you if they want to come to art residency, if they want to do something? What's the best way to connect with you and get involved? Uh, first or donate money. Some people might want to just donate money to your... How do they do that? Uh, first, we, yet we didn't take a donate yet, but now this COVID, after now we're thinking, um, artists who is coming here have to be pay a fee, little fee, and then we can uh, join this residency, uh, art and And uh, so, before we don't want to be like an artist because we now artists uh, have different, some have financially strong, some is not strong. So, it is good platform that 
So you charge people a little different yeah, according some to different. their social some, situation. Yes, sometimes we say if you have donation, you can give any donation, you can stay. We don't uh, uh, depend on the artist. Some artists say, oh, we have no money and we looking, the project is very interesting, her work is interesting, yeah, his work is very interesting. We say, okay, please come and stay. So you judge it upon not just their ability to pay, but you also judge it upon their propo proposal of what proposal, they plan yeah. to do. Yeah. Okay. Well, that sounds good. And if they want to contact you, they find what? Uh, they, they find contact you on Facebook found where just mostly uh, I mostly every year I visit uh, different different residency and through contact. And after also even my other friends, they also going there. They present showing sheet residency. And also through website, we have website through website also contact through emails and uh, so if they're interested they should contact you through the website and many you know unlimited art residency we advertise there also many so, other residencies. so what is what is the name of the website what do they search for uh showing sheet uh, residency and art junction also art junction now we have different uh, web blog okay. so art junction residency art junction blogspot.com just art junction residency can search in india our Junction from. Residency India or Sewing Seed also Residency they India, and they yeah. will find it You'll and then they it, can yeah. contact yeah. you in some way. Yeah. But you actively search for people too. You don't necessarily wait for people to come to you. You also search. No, we didn't search actually. No? No, mostly. Okay. Uh, when uh, we put the Sewing Seed, uh, the Art Junction or Sewing Seed Residency uh, project, specific one project, then we put on different, different websites. Okay. Otherwise, they search and then they come. Okay, and good. through friend or friend, they are also recommended through friends. Now, last night, 2009 too. So, we have many big circle and they are coming and uh, yeah, they have each other talking. I say, oh, let's go there. We have to be some groups are making project. Oh, we are coming group artist. I say, okay, welcome. Chiman Dangi, it's been really nice talking to you. I'm going to end this because we try to keep them to a half hour. Okay. This will probably be more than a half hour anyway. And we'll premiere it on Sunday night with any luck in my editing. So thank you for letting welcome. me come out here, have a chai with you. Thank you. At welcome. Art Junction Residency outside of Udaipur. This is Eva Lowe saying goodbye. Thank you for joining. Please remember to like and subscribe. Really helps the channel if you like, subscribe, comment, give some of your own opinions about art residencies or what you think of this video. Always helps. Thank you very much. Bye. Thank you very much. Are you recording? So this is a good test.